Hello friends and everyone out there. Welcome to the channel The Knowledge Hub where you will get any sort of knowledge of any field, any subject, any type. You can always demand for it and it will be available. Now today we are going to discuss about the mini micro sheets that are used in the uh, micro teaching skills practice in B at first year. Now these mini sheets are given during the micro teaching and uh, the timing for this is only six minutes. So I'm going to give you uh, this. This is for the subject of mathematics. The sub subject here is arithmetic and the topic is fraction. The duration we are given for this micro teaching is six minutes. Now this is how the sheet looks like and uh, we are going to first begin. Now we have five skills. Let me first tell you about this. We have five skills here. The first one is the introductive. The second is the explaining skill, the third is the blackboard skill, the fourth one is the questioning skill and the fifth one is reinforcement skill. So to begin with this is the first skill introductive in which we are going to begin with introducing our topic. Now our topic here is fraction. So first we have these questions from the teacher and students are answering these questions. So by given this introduction, students now have an idea about the topic fraction. Okay, and then these are the components that have been used. This is about the first skill introductive. Now if you talk about the second skill, this is explaining. In explaining what we do, we ask a question and then we give the proper answer of it. Now for example, what a fraction? A fraction is a part of a whole or more generally any number of equal parts. Okay, we have given the definition and then we are given the types. So we have six types, proper, improper, like, unlike, mixed and equivalent. Now while we are explaining, the students are listening carefully. That's the student activity. After explaining, we have the developmentary questions. That is what is a fraction and how many types. Now if the students are able to answer this, that means we have successfully explained and the students have carefully listened. We'll also make use of teaching aids. We can make a chart, okay? And this chart shall contain the topic, that is fraction, the definition briefly. Then uh, some drawings here show that a whole is equal to one. Half of it will be one by two. And one part, if divided into four, will be one by four. And then we have also listed the types of fractions here. And these are the components that have been used. So this is the explaining skill. Now after explaining, the teacher writes on the board. This is the blackboard skill here. Okay, we write the skill blackboard. Keep in mind, these take only 6 minutes. Now on the blackboard, as usual, we first label our blackboard properly. The date, the class, the subject, the sub-subject, the topic, then the period and the duration. We have given a, a brief definition of a fraction and then we have shown the parts of a fraction. The upper part is called the numerator and the lower or bottom part is called the denominator. The students write about a fraction in their notebooks carefully. Now it's the blackboard skill. So after writing on the board, the students note this neatly in their notebook. After this comes the fourth skill, questioning skill. Of course, that is question and answers. Now all what the teacher has taught, the pupil teacher's activity, the teacher asks questions and expects correct answers from the students. Now you see, what is a fraction? A part of a whole. Okay? How many types of fraction do we have? Students activity, the answer is six types. So as such, we have these questions and the students are answering them together. So this is the questioning skill. Finally, then we have the fifth skill, which is reinforcement skill. Now in reinforcement we have three parts, we have the pupil teacher's activity, the student's activity and reinforcement. That is the feedback we can say. So after asking a question, the student gives an answer. Depending on the type of answer, is it a complete answer, is it just half of the answer or is the student fully sure of it or not, we display the reinforcement skills as this. Good, well done, very good, very well good and as such. And these are the components here that are applied. So basically we have five skills in micro teaching as I said. The introductory skill, the explaining, the blackboard, 
the questioning and reinforcement skills. And this was for mathematics. Thank you.